shy. I'm just talking to you, girl. Hi everyone, so today I'm gonna to be doing the Get Your Freak On 15 Weird Facts tag. Yeah, okay, so whoever discovered this tag on YouTube, please change the name. Let it be Get Your Freak On tag or 15 Weird Facts tag. Like, pick one. Okay, so let's get on with it. All right. All right, so a nickname that I was called when I was little was called Brujis, which is um, Spanish for little witch. Yeah, little witch. Sounds mean. I was born in the month of October, which happens to be uh, Halloween month, and my mom thought it would be cute to just call me a little witch. Yeah, so sounds mean, but whatever. Um, the other nickname would have to be Sophie. Um, only a limited amount of people call me Sophie, usually the ones that are really close to me. Um, and me and my husband started a couple of nicknames between each other. Um, he calls me his little Juanita, which means like, okay, so if I'm cleaning or sweeping or um, doing laundry or cooking or whatever, he calls me his little Juanita like a live-in maid or whatever. Sounds degrading, I know, and prejudice or whatever, racist, I don't know. But I'm Mexican, so it's cool. Um, another nickname we started because we watched the movie Australia was Mr. Boss and Mrs. Boss, but I'll usually just say, okay, boss, and he'll be like, all right, boss, or whatever, to me all the time. Like if I ask him to do something, he'll be like, yeah, boss, yes, boss, yes, Mrs. Boss, whatever, yeah, so that's it. Weird habit of mine. Okay, so if I'm thirsty and I want something to drink, I'll, it, like before I even get um, my drink, I'll grab the cup out of the cupboard and I'll smell it. Like just to make sure it smells good or I'll look inside of it and make sure there's no bug or dust or if it's dirty or something, I'll do that. Um, another weird habit of mine is, which used to be before, but I used to leave like one bite of whatever on my plate and I wouldn't finish everything on my plate I would just leave one bite and then I would finish I don't know what that was about but um it's pretty weird I guess so a weird phobia that I have um is spiders and a lot of people have a phobia of spiders um but I have a really big phobia of spiders out here in Belgium only because they're huge out here but um, besides that, I don't really have any other weird ones. I used to hate dentists, but um, I'm totally over that now. I don't really have any specific songs. I like Prince a lot and I'll blast him, but it's not in secret because I don't, I think Prince is cool and I will tell you that, so it's not a huge secret. Um, but Kiss by Prince or 1999 or Purple Rain or, um, when Doves Cry, like, I love those songs of Prince and I will blast them. I really don't care. But I don't really have any other secret songs I like to blast. But one of my biggest pet peeves would have to be spelling or grammar. And I cannot stand it when a grown adult will type or write out on their Facebook or wherever, Twitter, or whatever, blog, I don't care. When they will write like words such as with, like W-I-T, wit. Like what is that? Or good is G-U-D, or this, like this is this for them, like D-I-S, or dat, dat? No, that, that. There's a T-H-A-T, not D-A-T. I cannot stand that. Okay, I went to school and I know at my school they did not teach us how to write like that at all. So I don't know what school, if you went to a special school or something, but what is that? And when adults do it, like it really bugs me. Like when teenagers do it, okay, fine. That's their thing. But when adults do it, like it really, really, I don't know, like it bugs the crap out of me. So that's one of my biggest pet peeves. And I have other ones, but uh, there's no need to get into those. So, a nervous habit of mine. Um, I don't really have too many except for maybe uh, talking really fast or like if I'm really nervous, I'll get sweaty. Like I'll get hot and like you could see my forehead glistening if I'm nervous. Like, But other than that, I don't really have any other nervous habits. It's the right side. I always sleep, yeah, on the right. It used to be the left and my husband and I, we switched sides 
and you could totally tell we switched sides because on his side now like all my shoes are under him and then all of his shoes are under my side so yeah but I don't know why we switched I can't remember why Okay, so my stuffed animal when I was little was a lamb and her name was Wilma and she's from an animal show and now I can't even remember what animal show she's from. But she was a yellow lamb and her name was Wilma and she had roller skates. Roller skates. So yeah. Um, okay, so I have not been to a Starbucks in over four years or maybe longer. But what I used to get was the white chocolate mochiato. I don't know if that's even a drink there anymore or if it was. I don't know. White chocolate and it had mocha in it. So, yeah. But what I would also get would be like the frappuccinos in a bottle. Um, the vanilla ones and the cold drinks. The ones that you could get at Walmart or whatever. But, yeah. I used to get those. The frappuccinos. Wearing lotion. Okay, I cannot stand it when people have really like dry arms or dry legs, but I'm totally guilty of that. Like sometimes I'll walk out of the house and I will notice like when I get in the car and we're already leaving, like I'll notice I need lotion on my arms or on my legs or whatever and I cannot stand it. Like I'll either have to drive back and get lotion or I'll just have to like suck it up, but I cannot stand that. I face like if you have to exit, I face the exit because I've seen so many movies where people have been attacked while they've been in the shower or gotten killed or something. So I have this weird like feeling that somebody's going to come in and attack me. I also have a really weird feeling like if I'm shampooing my hair and I get shampoo all in my face, like I have to wipe it away really fast because I have to have like clear view of what's going on in the shower or outside of the shower. Like... I don't know. So usually I'll face like the shower will be behind me or whatever. I mean, occasionally, yeah, I'll turn around. Obviously, I have to like wash my body or whatever. But normally, like I would face the exit because I'm totally afraid someone's going to come in and do something to me. So, yeah. I don't think I do. Um, I can roll my tongue like a taco like like that. But that's the only thing I can think of. I can't even whistle. Like that's how much of a body skills I don't have. One of my favorite, most favorite comfort foods would have to be mint Oreo cookies, the double stuffed ones. I love Oreo cookies. And if there isn't any mint at the store, I could just get regular Oreos. Um, but it has to be Oreo cookies and milk. Like, yeah, I have to like dunk them until they're super, super soggy and then like eat them really fast. Um, but I love, love, love Oreo cookies. It doesn't matter what flavor, but mint. I prefer mint ones. Um, I also like um, like chips. I love uh, chili cheese Fritos with bean dip. Um, love it. And what else? Oh, Doritos with cottage cheese. Sounds gross, I know, but I like it. And um, Doritos with lime juice and tapatio. Yeah, tapatio sauce. If you don't know what that is, uh, go to your local Mexican store on the corner. And go look for some tapatio because it put it on your Doritos with a little bit of lime juice and yeah. So those are some of my comfort foods. I might have other ones like, um, no, I don't. Those are it. So favorite phrase. Oh my gosh. I don't think I have any favorite phrases. If I do have them, you guys would probably know because I probably say it a lot like in videos and stuff, but I don't really have too many favorite ones or any trademark phrases. Um, probably stuff like that, things like that. Um, so, or I don't know. I don't really have any trademark phrases or anything. Okay, what I love to sleep in. I have to have socks on and um, shorts and a tank top would have to be what I sleep in um but I don't really like wearing like pants to sleep or anything um I just like shorts and a tank top or one of my husband's t-shirts but that's basically what I truthfully always like to wear when I sleep um I don't have anything cute like Victoria's Secret pajamas or anything um but yeah so that's it so 
If you would really love to do this tag, definitely um, do it. I am tagging my husband because he needs to do something for his channel. Um, but any of you um, who are watching this, you are automatically tagged and video response it below. Um, I will be looking for it. Or comment all your answers um, down there. Um, and yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this one. If you have any other questions you'd like to ask me or whatever, definitely ask them down below. I have no problem doing a questions and answers video. But um, yeah, so I will talk to you later. Bye. This is all y'all, all y'all, all over, all over.